guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're here to do a spring clothing haul. I say spring loosely because here in Minnesota it seems to be non-existent, but nonetheless, welcome to my spring clothing haul. Okay, so today a hot mess of a video, but that's just how I roll. Um, I have both my kids in here. I've got Kaya over here and I've got Riker over here. I'm by myself with the kids tonight. So they are both in my video with me. So if there's chaos or like movement going on behind me, that's why. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to touch, I've got like each like thing organized as to like where I got it from. Um, and then I'm going to do like a little bit of a voiceover and try these on for you as well. First place I wanna start out with is Thread Tank. Now Thread Tank is a like a graphic like boutique store. So they have a bunch of t-shirts graphic t-shirts on their website that you can choose from and they go all the way to double XL. And for me, I am a curvier mama and I usually wear like a large-ish, large XL sometimes. Um, but I did size up in their t-shirts to a double XL because I've really been loving tying my t-shirts up in the front. Um, not only is that like in style right now, but I'm also loving that it kind of hides the baby pooch, if you will. Now Thread Tank, when you get them in the mail, they come in the most adorable packaging and it has like a sticker on it that says stories that you can wear. You guys, I can't tell you how like blown away I was with the quality. I've been wanting to get some really good graphic t-shirts for this spring and this summer. Um, we go camping a lot in the summertime and I really just love a super comfy t-shirt. Um, these are the softest cotton. A lot of times, I told you guys in my Instagram story when I opened this up, um, a lot of times when you get like a t-shirt, like a graphic t-shirt, whenever I get graphic t-shirts, I always worry it's gonna be too starchy or the fit's gonna be really weird. These are amazing and they are true to size. Again, I just sized up because I wanted to be able to like tie them up and have some fun with them and have them like loose and flowy. Um, but again, they are true to size. The first t-shirt that I picked out was the Mother Hustler design because come on you guys, do I need to explain why? I love this like charcoal -y color. This is super flattering yes, on. Again, it's like super here. comfortable. Um, and I would definitely it layer it during the springtime with like a cardigan or like with a like a jacket or just I don't know graphic t-shirts are so in right now I'm loving that you can like dress them up or dress them down um, I would definitely definitely wear um, a graphic t-shirt like out downtown if I was like going for drinks with my husband um, etc again the first one mother hustler super cute um, the second one that I chose was more of an army green color and um, again I got a double XL in it because I wanted it to be like super flowy and roomy and so I could like tie it up in the front and this one says grateful and the I mean the material you guys is just so soft it's so comfortable and I'm I'm obsessed. I need like all of their t-shirts. This is what I'm gonna live in this summer. All right, so that is going to wrap it up for Thread Tank. Now, the next portion of my video is going to be one of my favorites and what I get the most questions on, and that is my cardigans from Ruli. Ruli is an online boutique. I believe that they have a physical location down in Utah as well. All of my like super cute cardigans are from Ruli. Now I lucked out and I started like I guess this is more of like fall colors, but whatever um, This is a part of my spring haul because I wear a lot of cardigans in the spring If you guys have seen my Instagram, you know that I'm obsessed with this like Whatever copper color I guess is what I would call this um, This is a really really long cardigan and it's like a color blocked cardigan so at the bottom it has um, like a black, a gray, a cream, and then this copper on top. Um, and then it also has a hood, which is a bonus for me. I absolutely am obsessed with that cardigan. The second cardigan that I got from Ruli, very similar. I just couldn't decide between the two. So I just got both of them. Um, it's a very similar color. So as you can see, like rust copper, copper rust. I don't know, maybe like, uh, this looks like a little mustardy on camera, but it's not mustardy. Um, this one is a little bit more rusty colored. It's like a reddish, brownish, I don't know, but I'm obsessed with this one as well. Again, super long. This one's a little bit more stretchy and thin. This one's definitely thicker. Um, and then this one also has a hood. Again, very similar to the first one, but this one's just a little bit thinner. 
and I have decision making problems so I couldn't decide between the two. So the third piece that I got from Ruli is this like color blocked mustard colored sweater. Um, ooh, wow, this looks like really strange colored on camera. Um, this is actually like a really pretty like deep yellow color. It's looking really green on the screen right now. Um, but this one does not have a hood. It is thicker so it would be for like a cooler spring day. A lot of these double for fall sweaters but again I wear so many cardigans in the spring and I happen to catch these on sale so they just happen to be a part of my spring clothing haul. I'll probably wear them all year round though. This one also has pockets, super cute. Very comfy and definitely color scheme is up my alley. All right, so the last piece that I got from Ruli, as you guys can tell, I'm on a graphic tee kick. Um, I just got this, I don't even know what it says, adventure something something. Um, this one I also sized up in, in a double XL, um, and then I tied up in the front. Um, this is very much so supposed to be like um, a tighter fit t-shirt. I don't, I don't know how to explain it. It seems to, it seems to me like it's supposed to fit a little bit tighter than, um, the way that I wear it, but yeah, super cute, tied up in the front and another great camping t-shirt for me. So that will double as like a summer piece for me when I'm just like flexing at like the campsite, like the bonfire or whatever. All right, so that is going to wrap it up for my Ruli part of the video. What I'm gonna move into next is going to be my Target haul part of the video. I get a lot of my clothes from Target. Like there was a point in time where all of my clothes were from Target. I have really been loving their rompers lately. I've just been getting into rompers. I've gotta show you guys this romper that I got. Um, I got this in an XL. And I probably could have sized down, but it was the only size left, and I couldn't pass this romper up. So it is like a little big on my shoulders, but I just kind of pull it off as like classy, maybe like off one shoulder a little bit. Um, and if you guys have seen my Instagram post with my romper on, I'm actually wearing this romper in one of my thumbnails on my channel, and I got a couple questions as to where I got it. Target, I got it from Target, and it's like super stretchy, like bouncy. Um, and it also has like this cute like tie in the front and I'm just, I'm absolutely obsessed. I actually got it for my brother's wedding coming up, but I am probably going to like brighten it up a little bit with like a, like a blue kimono or something of a sort. His colors are blue and like a grayish silver. All right, so that is that romper. Um, something, I have no idea what I drank that morning that I went to Target, but I had to get this mom jacket. Um, this mom jacket, I wore it in one of my other sit down videos. It's very 80s and I love it. It's like, I would say like late 80s, early 90s. When I'm wearing this in my black Under Armour hat, I just am like, yes, I'm a soccer mom. I've accepted my role. Like, I fit, I fit the part. Kaya just fell over in a laundry basket. So anyways, soccer mom, like 90s jacket, super cute. The next thing I got from Target is my new favorite piece, this hat. I absolutely love this hat. I think it goes with everything. I'm gonna make it go with everything because I'm obsessed with it. It's just, come on you guys, like how? I should wear it for the rest of the video. I think I just might. <laughs> Moving on to the last thing that I got from Target, I, I'm i realizing now that everything that I've purchased is like meant for like tying up in the front, probably because it hides my baby pooch, but we're just, um, we're just going to accept that I like this type of look, I guess. Um, I actually got this on clearance and this would definitely be like a winter piece, um, but I, it's the Wild Fable brand from Target. And it, it does, again, it ties up in the front. You guys have seen me wear this shirt in like all of my videos. Um, I also have a short sleeve version, but I got it from Amazon and I have that. Actually, I talked about that t-shirt in my What's in My Hospital Bag video. But this, yes, so cute and it goes with everything. Okay, the rest of my video, I've got like a couple pieces from each place. Um, Definitely went to the mall and had a little bit of fun when I, when I was on maternity leave and like got myself some like 
new fun pieces that I wasn't able to enjoy while I was pregnant and then a couple of pieces again that made me really comfortable in my postpartum body something some things that I knew I could wear um, throughout the transition of the seasons because very soon here it's going to be hot in the lake season. Pretty soon here in Minnesota, it is going to be like scorching humid weather. So um, I got a couple of these pieces to make sure that I could wear them um, during those days. All right, so the next store that I want to hop into is Maurice's. Now, I love Maurice's for like certain things. I have a really hard time shopping at Maurice's because I feel like, mm, I don't know, just like the prints or it's hard for me to find things in there. I just wanted to find like a couple of really simple t-shirts um, that I could wear in, into the spring and the summer. And again, something I could tie up in the front or I could like tuck into my jeans and like really hide my mom pooch. Um, I really should have sized down on these. I bought these when I was one month postpartum and they're huge on me. They're absolutely huge on me. I bought these in an XL and I really wish that I wouldn't have. I wish I would have gotten it in like a medium or a large just because I think they were meant to fit oversized anyway. Um, they're very large, but super cute on underneath a cardigan. You can see on this one, I've got it tied up in the front, but again, like these are so oversized that if I didn't, it would look like I'm wearing a garbage bag, a colored garbage bag. Um, but very cute. They are longer in the back too, so they cover your bum. So if you're like wearing leggings, your butt's not gonna show. And let's be honest, all I'm wearing these days are leggings or jiggings. <laughs> I got another color in that same t-shirt, cute pocket on the front, longer in the back, shorter in the front. And again, I tied it up. Um, and this I thought was a really cute like spring color, but again, you could really um, wear this in the fall as well. Last piece I got from Maurice's were a really, really cute pair of jeans, which I will show you guys in the try on. I'll be wearing them with one of my t-shirts. Um, very cute, very forgiving. Um, I like my back pockets to be like super plain. Um, I don't know why, but, and then like just a little bit destroyed on the front, nothing too crazy. So just a little bit of um, distressing, a couple holes, very cute. Next door, I only have one piece from, and that's American Eagle. I went there to get my husband some jeans because he was really, really lacking on the jeans. And he needed like a couple of nice dark pairs. Um, he wears like, I believe it's a skinny, original skinny straight or something like that, if you guys are curious. Um, but this is the pair that I got from American Eagle and my favorite are the bottoms. They're like the distress. They're almost like that, I don't know, what's that one brand? Can Can, they're very similar to like the Can Can jeans. Um, but yeah, the distressing on the ends were my favorite. And honestly, I have not bought myself jeans in 10 years. So branching out and getting these jeggings was like a huge step for me. Again, I really love these jeans. They're high-waisted, they're really comfy, and they're very forgiving. Moving into the last part. So one of my favorite boutiques in our mall here is called Dry Goods. I can never like find the same things online as I do when I go in the store. I'm very much so like an in-store clothing shopper for like t-shirts. Um, cardigans, I really do purchase a lot of those online, but if it's gonna be a t-shirt or like a fancy blouse, I do tend to like go to the store and try them on because everything fits so differently. So that's what I did on this day and I was pleasantly surprised at like how great thing things were like fitting me one month postpartum. Um, you guys have seen me wear this t-shirt a lot. Again, tie up in the front. I'm embarrassed, you guys. I seriously have way too many of these like tie up in the front t-shirts whatever judge me it's whatever um but i've clearly worn this quite a few times the only thing that i would complain about with this shirt is it has pilled up um i mean i've maybe worn it i mean i say i've worn it a ton but i only got it like a month ago and i've worn it like 10 times so um like probably less than that like once a week i wear it so like maybe five times i've worn this shirt and it's already kind of pilling and beach crap in the front, but it is a very cute color and it's 
super flattering. I'm going on any skin tone, any what hair color. I feel like this is a really versatile yeah. color. The next piece that I got from Dry Goods is this really like simple, elegant, um, like little sweater. It's not a sweater, it's really thin. Again, like this is a spring haul. I clearly don't like floral prints, I just am realizing that. Sorry I don't like Easter bright colors and floral prints. I am a very dull person who only likes the same colors. Sorry. But I had gotten this for a benefit that my husband and I went to when Riker was like three weeks old. He was really young. Um, and I needed something, again, pretty forgiving, but something that I could wear to the office when I went back to work. Um, and honestly, it's it's just so flattering. It's beautiful. I really love the color, obviously. It's copper. <laughs> um, sorry, not sorry. The last piece that I got from Dry Goods is this really cute, like, I don't even know what to call this. This, like, shirt thing. Um, it is short sleeve. I thought it would be really cute paired with, like, a tank top underneath during the summertime with, like, some tan like lace up sandals super light has lots of movement to it kind of along the same color scheme that i tend to um go on at least it's not all black you guys there was a once upon a time where i only wore black maybe because it matched my soul now the last um shirt that i want to cover is this oatmeal tie up shirt <laughs> um I have really, really loved this for postpartum. Now, I know that this shirt is more so leaning towards winter. Again, remember, like, springtime is, like, 30 degrees here, so it is cold. Um, but this was one of my favorite t-shirts postpartum, and this is from one of my absolute favorite local online boutiques. You guys asked me when I was pregnant where I wore, or where I got all of the sweaters that I wore. All of my sweaters were from Katie Marie Boutique, and she is actually local to my area, started her own online boutique, and I'm obsessed. Um, this was the shirt that I had gotten from her. This was an XL, so probably why I loved it so much for postpartum. I wore this like my first days out of the hospital. Um, it has like a little cutout here, and I love wearing this with jeans. This was just all around a great shirt. All right, you guys, well, that is going to wrap it up for today's hot mess of a clothing haul video. Clearly, I like tie-up shirts, and clearly, I really like the same colors, and I really like tie-up shirts, and I just noticed it today, so... Yeah. All right. I will also be doing a summer clothing haul very, very soon for you guys because we don't get transitions. We don't get spring here in Minnesota. Like I said, it's like 30 degrees most of the time. And all of a sudden it jumps up to 70, 80 degrees every single day. So I will very quickly be needing to do a summer haul as well. So stay tuned for that as I am going through my postpartum weight loss journey, finding like things that I'm comfortable with that kind of hide the baby skin, the baby pooch a little bit because I don't have the best of genetics and even after I've lost all of my pregnancy weight, the skin just is still there and I still have like a good 60 pounds left to lose um, before I'm at like a really comfortable weight or before I'm at my dream goal weight. If you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. This was really hard to record with two kids in the room trying on all these clothes. I'm very sweaty and very hot. <laughs> Make sure that you subscribe to my channel before you leave and click that bell notification. I will be sharing so many really fun things coming up with you guys after we're done with hibernation here in our house. Um, we are ready for the spring. We're ready to go camping, explore, and do all the fun things. And I also have a really fun weight loss journey coming up for you guys, um, as well as lots of like breast pumping stuff. So stay tuned for all the goods in the future. And I will see you guys on Thursday for another really fun video. Okay, bye you guys. Myself. What a wonderful world. What a wonderful world.